Great matchup here with Phoebe Bacon on lane four, Reagan Smith in lane five. Bacon comes in with a personal best of 208.34, which she did this morning in the prelims. That puts her at number nine in the world standing. Reagan Smith currently 10th in the world standings at 208.74. That was her swim from this morning, and the two of them are separated by just nine one hundredths through the first 50. 29.40, the lead split, that's Phoebe Bacon. Third, Mariella Venter, lane six, 30.76. U.S. Open record, 205.68, set in 2013 by Missy Franklin with the Colorado Stars. That could be in jeopardy here if these swimmers keep this pace up. Pair of 101s, now Reagan Smith with just the 1-100th advantage over Phoebe Bacon. Quite the show going on in lanes four and five. 31-7 on that 50 from Smith to take the lead. Venter still in third from lane six. Fourth is Alex Walsh, but this race here belongs to lanes four and five. Going into the final turn, it's Phoebe Bacon taking the lead. Through the third 50, Bacon 32-72, Smith at 32-79. Still less than a tenth separating these two swimmers. Smith out of the final wall comes up with the advantage. Looks like Smith had the underwater, but Bacon a little faster on top of the water. Phoebe Bacon now side by side with Reagan Smith. Stroke for stroke to the finish, seven meters to go. And at the final wall, it is Phoebe Bacon with a 206.84. Unofficially the third best time in the world for 2021. And right behind her with the fourth best time in the world, Reagan Smith at 206.90. Mariella Venter third at 212.11. Ladies and gentlemen, everyone in the building, put your hands together for Phoebe Bacon and Reagan Smith. What a race.